Welcome to the vlog. It's Obezy. Day 16 walking across America. My third cop encounter this trip just commenced. Um, he just, I, I asked him, oh, I'm so sorry. I, I was just coming down off the Appalachians or whatever, blah, blah, blah. He's like, oh, no, you're fine. You could, it was fine that you stayed here. I just wanted to check up, make sure everything was okay. Just filled up on water, packed my stuff behind my back. I have extra food, so it's gonna be a little bit heavier. There are those damned Appalachian trails up there in those mountains. I follow the path of the road now. Much easier. So I just looked up stuff on the map. I saw a laundry map that I went ahead to. Um, they said I've traveled eight and a half miles and I have ten more miles to go, so. We're just gonna pack up that food I was eating and get ready to go. About the third mini town I've passed through. If you look over there, I see a bunch of people just eating some sort of picnic thing. I'm about to get run over by this truck. And, uh, yeah. It's just pretty much walking. Interesting cop cars. But not much these days, not much at all. down. It's just strange. The past couple of towns I've walked through just look like, you know, like a normal town with this one. All the houses are like, like they've got some sort of wear and tear on them. I'm serious. It's like everyone decided to move out of this town. Look at that house. It's just totally, the house is totally just boarded up. The one next to it looks like it's had some major issues. What the heck kind of town am I in? Even the stop signs are all junked up. And in general just positioned weirdly. This is very strange. Well, that's a gun shop. It's good to know they sell used guns in this town. Maybe that's why no one's on the streets. What the heck? The town ambulance is parked right next to the gun shop? Well, I guess people immediately get guns and then... I mean, it kind of makes sense. Start creating chaos. They put the ambulance right next to the uh, gun shop. I don't know, this is going to wacky place. What I don't get, I've seen absolutely nobody on the streets or even in their yards. I, the only people I saw were these construction workers a little while back, working on the road. Where are the people? Strange. I just stopped inside this Dunkin' Donuts to <clears throat> grab some really nothing I didn't buy anything I just stopped in to rest my feet grab a seat and now I'm hitting the road they say four more miles to a laundry mat ta -da. 18 miles later we made it to the laundry mat so I have walked 17 miles in six hours compared to the Appalachian Trail which was seven miles in seven hours so I think obviously walking on the road is gonna get me there a lot get me to Florida a lot faster and I'm not really trying to dilly dally exactly 17 miles in six hours compared to seven miles in seven hours I'm just saying looks like we finally got to the heart of this uh, town I I honestly just start looking up names I just pick a location on the map that has like Lots of stuff near it, and I choose to go there. But wherever we are, yeah, I'm in. Uh, I feel like I'm in the heart of it. I'm in the hustle and bustle. All right, so these guys hooked me up with some power behind this uh, vending machine. All right. Uh, my name is Josh. Nice to meet you all. My name is Richard. Nice to meet you. 
From Bawa? Bawa, New Jersey. New Jersey. Yeah, I couldn't find anywhere. I've been running up and down. What? Damn. Damn. That's long. Did it. Chilling at Acme. I'm with uh, Josh and Richard. We're here. It's, uh, it's way better than the park. The park was like hard, uh, hard pavement everywhere, but this place is comfortable. Peace out, Obizi.